The Northrop Grumman E-2 Hawkeye is an American all-weather, carrier-capable tactical airborne early warning e -war, aircraft. This twin turboprop aircraft was designed and developed during the late 1950s and early 1960s by the Grumman Aircraft Company for the United States Navy as a replacement for the earlier, piston-engined E-1 Tracer, which was rapidly becoming obsolete. The aircraft's performance has been upgraded with the E-2B and E-2C versions, where most of the changes were made to the radar and radio communications due to advances in electronic integrated circuits and other electronics. The fourth major version of the Hawkeye is the E-2D, which first flew in 2007. The E-2 also received the nickname Super Fud because it replaced the WF, later E-1, Willy Fud. In recent decades, the E-2 has been commonly referred to as the Hummer because of the distinctive sounds of its turboprop engines, quite unlike that of turbojet and turbofan jet engines. In addition to U.S. Navy service, smaller numbers of E-2s have been sold to the armed forces of Egypt, France, Israel, Japan, Mexico, Singapore, and Taiwan. The latest E-2 version is the E-2D Advanced Hawkeye, which features an entirely new avionics suite including the new NAP-9 radar, radio suite, mission computer, integrated satellite communications, flight management system, improved T-56A-427A engines, a glass cockpit and aerial refueling. The AP-9 radar features an active electronically scanned array, which adds electronic scanning to the mechanical rotation of the radar and its radome. The E-2D includes provisions for the copilot to act as a tactical fourth operator, T-40, who can reconfigure his main cockpit display to show radar, IF, LINK-16, JTIDS, SEC and access all acquired data. The E-2D's first flight occurred on 3 August 2007. On 8 May 2009, an E-2D used its cooperative engagement capability system to engage an overland cruise missile with a standard missile SM-6 fired from another platform in an integrated fire control system test. These two systems will form the basis of the Naval Integrated Fire Control, Counter Air, NIFC California, when fielded in 2015.
The AP-9 radar has been suspected of being capable of detecting fighter-sized stealth aircraft, which are typically optimized against high frequencies like Ka, Ku, X, C and parts of the S-bands. Small aircraft lack the size or weight allowances for all spectrum low observable features, leaving a vulnerability to detection by the UHF band AP-9 radar, potentially detecting fifth-generation fighters like the Russian Sukhoi Su-57 and the Chinese Chengdu J-20 and Shenyang J-31. Historically, UHF radars had resolution and detection issues that made them ineffective for accurate targeting and fire control. Northrop Grumman and Lockheed claim that the AP-9 has solved these shortcomings in the AP-9 using advanced electronic scanning and high digital computing power via space-time adaptive processing. According to the Navy's NIFC California concept, the E-2D could guide fleet weapons, such as AIM-120 AMRAAM and SM-6 missiles, onto targets beyond the launch platform's detection ranger capabilities. The E-2D Advanced Hawkeye is a game-changer in how the Navy will conduct battle management command and control. By serving as the digital quarterback to sweep ahead of strike, manage the mission, and keep our net-centric carrier battle groups out of harm's way, the E-2D Advanced Hawkeye is the key to advancing the mission, no matter what it may be. The E-2D gives the warfighter expanded battle space awareness, especially in the area of information operations delivering battle management, theater air and missile defense, and multiple sensor fusion capabilities in an airborne system.